Up tonight as we enter a new year, a Corpus Christi family is living with the same devastating question. Where is Christina Torres? 19 years ago, the search began for her when she failed to pick up her young daughter as planned. Uh, even though all this time has passed, police say there have been no new leads in the case, but Christina's family has not lost hope. Our Madeline Dart has the update on this top story. 6,935 days. That's how long Christina Torres' family has wondered, where could she be? Every year, January the 2nd, you know, I, I put it out there and I hope that people will share it mm -hmm. and that somebody will see it and know something or say something. Cynthia Torres remembers the panic and confusion when Christina didn't pick up her daughter from her dad's house. They filed a missing persons report and one week later, Christina's car was discovered off of I-37 near Mathis. Once they found her car, then I knew something was wrong. I knew something had happened to her. Cynthia says there was a note on her car reading, don't look for me in her handwriting. Then investigators found a note in Christina's work locker. Allegedly, she wrote about starting her life over, but her family didn't buy it. She would not leave her daughter behind. She would have at least told me something like, you know, I'm going to go out of town. We know that she's not, she's probably not alive. You know, she's not, I, I, I don't think so. Cynthia says everyone close to her sister was questioned and still no one has been found responsible for her disappearance. 19 years later, they hold on to a glimmer of hope by supporting Christina's daughter. You know, how can you go without your mom? It's hard. She needs her mom. For now, Cynthia remembers the happy memories with her little sister. I hear country music and it reminds me of her, especially Shania Twain. She just loved dancing to man. I feel like a woman. <laughs> Madeline Dart, three news.